News 46 is brought to you by Dr. George Leakes, a Rump's optometrist since 1990, offering full-spectrum eye care for children and adults. Call today, 727-8300. News is also brought to you by J.K. Nelson Law. Call 727-9900 today for your free consultation. If you need a lawyer, you need Nelson. on News 46, a home, trailer, and motorcycle are lost to fire, and a driver is injured after rolling his car. News 46 starts now. You're watching KPVM News 46 with Deanna O'Donnell. News 46, local coverage you can count on. The investigation is underway following a house fire. It's August 21st. I'm Deanna O'Donnell. A local resident is picking up the pieces following a fire that took place in the early morning hours on Saturday. Early Saturday morning, we were dispatched for an unknown type fire. There were numerous uh, callers, but there were also numerous addresses provided because it was uncertain as to where they exactly they saw the fire. It was more described as a glow in the sky. There was a report of explosions, things along those lines. As our, cries, our crews arrived in the area, they found a fifth wheel trailer that was fully involved at the rear of the property. It had extended to the primary double wide manufactured dwelling. It had also extended to an accessory outbuilding as well as a closely placed motorcycle. You know, the, the explosions are undetermined at this point. There was no clear indicators during the investigation of what may have caused explosions other than it may have been the tires on the fifth wheel trailer. The fifth wheel trailer was unoccupied, however, it was being prepared. They were doing some renovations within the interior in preparation as somebody was going to be moving in. It sustained uh, severe exterior damage on the, the rear face, on the, the rear side of the structure, as well as it also created a large hole as it went into the attic space early in the fire. Our crews upon arrival found heavy fire through the roof of the double wide. They commenced an interior attack, stopped the forward progress of that fire and while also fighting the fifth wheel trailer at the same time. They are fine, they did get out of the house. In fact, they weren't at the address at the time of the fire. They were returning when they in turn saw the glow as well. They were one of the original 911 callers. The fire's under investigation and Deputy State Fire Marshal will be traveling out the prompt tomorrow and they're gonna to be putting another set of eyes on it. And Pahrump Valley Fire and Rescue and KPVM-TV would like to welcome back to active duty firefighter paramedic Lieutenant Kevin Klickner. Ten sailors are missing and five injured following another Navy ship collision in the Pacific. The Navy warship collided with a commercial tanker east of Singapore. The U.S. Defense Department wants answers as to why these crashes are happening. The collision between the USS John S. McCain, a guided missile destroyer, and the merchant vessel is the fourth this year. Officials intend to conduct a comprehensive review of recent U.S. Navy collisions to determine any of the causal factors and find out what's going on. On. Meanwhile, they are searching the area for the 10 missing military personnel. Nevada Highway Patrol is looking into the cause of a single vehicle rollover that occurred Saturday morning. Uh, we dispatched for a one vehicle rollover in the area of Highway 160 and Blosser. Upon arrival, found a vehicle resting on its roof. And while there was entrapment at the early stages, Nye County Sheriff's deputy uh, found it that he could pry one of the doors open. He assisted that occupant out. That occupant was evaluated on scene and then transported to a local hospital. It appeared to be non-life-threatening injuries. All right, and that was only one person inside this vehicle? Yes. We're going to talk about the eclipse when we return.